How did you find us? This is our hidden lair. You guys are just in your garage. All I had to do was find your secret identity. Wait, you know our secret identity? It was pretty easy, actually. You guys are just kids. You really suck at being discreet. Cut! What are you doing? That's not the lines. But it's true, isn't it? Listen, this is Hollywood, all right? We're suspending our disbelief. This is not Hollywood. This is a B-rated film directed by teenagers. Did you even read the script? What script? I, I emailed it to you like nine times. I thought that was medicine. It, I put it in my spam folder. All right, that's it. We're, we're, we're letting you go. You can let me go anytime. I'm parked out front. No, we're cutting you loose. Fire me? You can't fire me. I'm flame retardant. At least that's what my dad tells me. <laughs> scripts. Give it back. Where I'm going, I don't need any scripts. Wait, stop! Oh God, God, Jesus, I'm so sorry. Are you all right, sir? Sorry, your purse, sir. Sorry, your purse. Um, actually, that's mine. Oh. Well, you never really know. Um, yeah, um, you're my hero, I guess. Your hero? Thank you for everything. What's going on over there? He just steal a costume? Yeah. Should, should we tell somebody? Nope. Let's see how it plays out. Calls have been coming in all day. Talks you being fired, not reading your script, and there, there's even a rumor that you hit a guy. Yeah, and? And now you're stealing equipment because you want to be a superhero? Exactly. And as my agent, I believe you should make all my life decisions. You know what, bro? Do whatever. I need guidance. I don't know. Do whatever, man. I just don't want to be your agent anymore. Exactly. You don't have to be. But you can be my partner. I want you to think about it. Just think. Okay. So if I want to be a hero, I've got to really work for it. What exactly do superheroes do? Give life advice? Save innocent civilians? Save cats from trees? Stop crying? Wait a second. Why not all of the above? Okay. Now I need a secret identity. Trixie, not again. Trixie, come on down. Trixie, come on. Come on, not again. Trixie, this is getting annoying. Come on, Trixie. Trixie. What's the matter, little girl? Stay in school. Don't drink. So your cat's up in a tree. No lottery. Get a job. You're welcome, citizen. These painkillers? I've got this. No, no, it's, it's okay. No. Recently, it seems that our city has been graced with the presence of a masked superhero. Here we have a girl whose cat was saved from a tree by that superhero. Tell us your story. He was weird. He kept insisting to save my cat. I could have just saved her myself. What are you doing? I do not know what you are talking about. That, that was you, wasn't it? Who, me? Your secret identity is supposed to be your real name. Okay. You got me. It's all right. I want in. In where? Remember those fools you used to work for? Sure. Well, while I was talking to them, I noticed something kind of suspicious. I'm intrigued. Long story short, remember that movie you were in? Yeah, they didn't write that. They bought it. And they've been buying scripts all this time. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to bust them. Let's do it. Okay, that's him. We can't do anything until the transaction is made. If we act premature.
Good. What brings you to these parts? Mom kicked me out of my house. Oh, uh, it's rough. She doesn't understand you like I do. I don't know. Those were the guys I was supposed to beat up in my movie. Relax, Richard. Just watch. That's it. Get them. Stop, fiends! I think we lost him. Justice has been served! An update on our town's local superhero. Reports have come in that this masked man has successfully brought down an intricate operation of illegal script trafficking between local amateur filmmakers. This man here claims to be a witness to this heroic act. Yeah, man, he was awesome. I wish I knew him. I wish I could get his autograph. 